<laughs> it took hundreds. You had to go back to the store and buy more. I'm surprised it didn't run away after the third one. Listen, you can talk all you want about the proper precautions and things, best left unknown, and blah blah blah, but when someone gives you disassembled pieces of magical artifact, I don't care who you are, you put that baby together. As the last piece of the first crown slotted into place, the whole thing started glowing with green light and humming, and that's when the things got weird. Before we knew what was happening, we were somewhere else, in an indistinct nowhere with misty walls glowing that same green. At least I would have given it to the storyteller. This is weird. Before us floating an elven man, all dressed up like some sort of king. Except that he wasn't a normal king, because the last time I checked, elven elves weren't see-through and their skin didn't give off whiffs of glowing smoke. He stared at us with his blank ghost eyes and said, You're neither witch nor worm. Who are you? So we told him. The truth, of course. The king nodded. My name is Lothoriel, once called Lothoriel the Wise. You're inside what was my pride and is now my prison, what you call the first crown. He gave an ugly smile. Behind him, a door manifests in the fog. He gestures, don't worry. Unlike me, I suspect you can leave whenever you like. Time is strange here. I don't know how many millennia I have passed in your world since Nerissa destroyed my kingdom of Rushwood. Only that all memory of it has been lost. With you younger races building your nation atop its ashes, my people are long dead and scattered. Only I remain trapped in this half-life, denied my proper rest, and forced to carry out petty tasks for which abomination bears my crown. All thanks to Nymph oh, the Nymph Queen. He looked at us expectantly, so we... Uh, I'm kind of curious. Asked him more about his kingdom. The ghost smiled. The smile looked pain. Behind him, the fox world's forming an image of a beautiful forest city. God's my kingdom. It was a thing of beauty, a forest city that wove the trees into its very walls. But now it's gone, destroyed by Nerissa and swallowed up by time and forest. He laughed bitterly. I believe you know my realm as part of your so-called stolen lands. How appropriate. Yet even your oldest books have forgotten me. And I while away the millennia here. Bound by Nerissa as bobble for her servants to squabble over so then we asked him about him about nurse and his imprisonment we'll check nurse the ghost snarled and if we didn't already know he was a ghost how much did this take 20 difficulty oh we have plus 23 okay so we can stick here for a while nurse the ghost snarled if we didn't already know he was a ghost we would have then. His face contorted in ways that would have broken a real elf skull. Behind him, the fox world, forming an image of a beautiful elven city. He jabbed a finger at it. Look, see my kingdom? See what was she destroyed? All of it gone. And why? Just add one more grain of dust to the nymph's queen's chalice. He shrieked, a sound full of madness and sorrow that seemed to stab through our ears and into our brains. And now she binds me here. I was a bottle for her servant to squall over. So then we... Asked him how to best fight Nerissa and her minions. The ghost laughed bitterly. Fight Nerissa? Child, if I knew how to kill Nymph Queen, would I still be trapped in this godforsaken crown? I can't take any direction against uh, against her, even at the command of my bear. He paused thoughtfully. Though I suppose her minions see my crown as a mark of station. An early witch and the wriggly man fight over it incessantly. To see it in someone else's hands might fluster them, cause them to make a mistake at a crucial moment. There was another pause, longer than this longer this time. At last, in a softer voice, the ghost said, Or, once you've left this place, you could command me to destroy this crown and set myself free. That made us all pause. We looked at each other, silently weighing our options, and then Oh uh, yeah. I thought I already blocked. Oh. Uh, there's a space now. Okay. Um, unrecognized command. Hold on. Ch -ch -ch. 
Let me get rid of the spot real quick. Hold on a second. Mm. Yeah, I'm just going to go to my Nightbot real quick. But like, if I block these guys, how am I ever going to become famous? Okay. I would not repeat that uh, quote that you sent me because it should block you if you do. <laughs> yeah, I just uh, I threw it into the blacklist words and phrases by uh, or with Nightbot. Right. Uh, it gives you a warning too. This one doesn't block block them. Um, I have another bot that I might try that with. Yeah, I just gotta. I thought I had the terms on there, but the one he used had another space. Okay, so where were we? before I was offered the chance of a lifetime to become famous, but I turned it down. Okay. We looked at each other silently. Uh, ask him what we'd do if we set him free. His face softened for a moment and could see the kind of leader he must once have been. Well, I, I'd go on to my just reward, I suppose. Be judged by Phrasma and join my people in the afterlife. So we agreed to set him free. He goes stared at us. Really? Slowly a smile spread across his face. I do believe you actually mean that. In that case, all I you have to do is speak my name, Lothoriel, and order me to destroy the crown and free myself. He frowned. You'll need to do it in the presence of someone powerful, as powerful as Nerissa herself. One of the eldest, perhaps. Or they're not so terrible hard to find. He bowed low and gestured to the door for me in the mist. Please return to your world and... With my thanks. And with that, we pass through the door. Cool. We're probably going to do it in front of uh, Shika. Yeah, it should prevent you, and if you keep doing it, you get banned. I think I have like a two or three thing. Enemy approaching. Stop me from getting the extra dungeon. Risk. Well, that sucks. <laughs> what? Okay, well, hello. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. We may be able to pull this off. Actually, I don't think we will. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. That was kind of rude. Is this before we... 
Nah. I think it'll be okay. We'll see, we'll see. I'll do a save before I talk to... What's his face? And then, um... We'll see if we can turn back the decision I made. I feel like it's very in character of me to not want someone to be stuck. So cheap when you actually know where they are. I say as they come to murder me from the side. Oh no! Feared? Yes, okay. No, no, Tristan, you can keep running. I need my damage healer. Handling this, kind of. What the hell? Where did you guys go? use this spell for the love of all that is holy wait 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 we can get it back oh this doesn't look good This isn't good. They got around us. Only managed to banish one? Oh dude, they're gonna mess him up. This is going to be a hard fight. I mean... <laughs> yeah, I'll make a hard save, but... I 
I feel like my character was a hard-headed person, and now that he's king, he's slightly arrogant. What troubles you? My character, not me. Right here, my friend. Okay, let's keep this here. Oh, wow, protection of energy is just stronger. Okay. We don't need that, though. Nope. I'm back up. Okay. So we were attacked from the side and over here. So let's just drop a fireball here. Lindsay, drop oil back here. Tear them apart. Repent. Okay. Oh, man. As long as he's not Leono. I'm not sure who Leono is. Okay, this is going to be rough. That's him again. Put you here. I will see this. Okay. You say that, but I'm not feeling confident. Yes, Lindsay, stand back so no one can use your magic. There we go. Spam this. This was not part of the plan. Okay, did he just hit? No, okay. He just got hit. All Thundercats. Man, it's been a minute. I was never that big into Thundercats. Not gonna lie. Just wasn't one that got me. Judge me all you want. I will see this through. Forgot about this. Okay. I stand ready. Let's go after it like this. Let's do this one first. 
Okay. Just throw this happy little fireball out here. Please do not run into the AoE. his movements okay not yet on that start casting these Lindsay try What do I want you to do? I doubt this is going to work, but... No. Oh, one of them scared. Do that. May I suggest another way wow. to use this spell? Oh no, 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 that was us that's feared. That's not good. Okay, what's he afflicted with? He's panicked. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Stay back. Jesus. Okay, he's off being panicked. Actually, no. I need you to cast this here. Cast this. I need you to cast a heal. I need you to drink. And I need to give her potions so she can drink potions. Okay, so we banished a couple. That's good. Um, let's try it again. Stop casting those. Um, nope, no, no. Let's do this. Q. 
Keep them up. Not many left. From here. Forgot about this spell. Which I don't even think I need. No. I'm so glad I threw up that aura after the fight. All according to plan. <laughs> OG Thundercats. Oh man. Good fight. It only took me a couple times. I'm curious, is the game gonna point me to the direction of this place, or was it just like one of those places I kinda had to find on my own? I found something. You find. That's the worst. Just found something. So happy he did. Now we can all celebrate with whatever great loot Tristan found. That's annoying. Maybe he just found himself. And you know what? That's okay. I'd rather have found treasure, but... Jesus, what is up? With this endless being jumped. I've discovered something. Okay. Please. I never know why I didn't get into Thundercats. Maybe it's because they were cats. Like, I don't have anything in cats. I've owned cats. I think that might be it. Because I'm thinking about the cartoons that I watched at the time, and I watched Conan. So you would think I would have been down with the Thundercats. It is finished. Stand with me. Let's try this way. Oh, wait, they're immune. He's just wasting spells on him. Be generous to them, for I am not. Lindsay's running. Oh god. And a magic broad grants this world the ability to make up to three spells that can be cast per day empowered as 
though using the empowered feet. Greater rod can be used with spells of ninth level or lower. Do, do. You enjoy that. A trivial matter. Oh, he's blind. Crap. Lindsay the Magnificent? Or Lindsay the Illustrious? Mm, something more simple, like Lindsay the Great. Mm. I think he's blind. Or what is this? Sickened. I almost wasted that on him. <laughs> Dude. It's not the size of the rod. It's the spells cast. I think that works. We're going with it though. Arnold A. Klein. Out of haste. Unfortunate. Well, that was kind of an adventure, this part of the map. Wait a second. There's loot up here. Shit. I have to go back. <laughs> We will do this one. You look up to find Shiko waiting for you at the edge of the tree, his arms crossed. Salem stands near the eldest, his arms crossed. He nods to you but says nothing. Well, she asks, did you get it? I got it for you. Here, I've got it, but I'm not giving it to you. Salem laughs. At Sheikah's shocked expression, he grins and claps them on the shoulder. You and your type never learn, do you? You think of us mortals as dogs to be trained, but we can simply surprise you. He turns to you, his expression is sober. In that case, I have a proposal. The ghost tied to this crown is a mortal soul, trapped and kept from its rightful afterlife. As an agent of Phrasma, goddess of death, I can take the crown to her realm and ensure the ghost is put to rest safely as he deserves. It's my job, actually. He looks you in the eye, so what do you want? Uh, yeah, neutral. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to set the ghost free myself. Because that's what I plan to do. Are you sure? Salem frowns. Are you sure? Undeath twists the mind. Even ghosts formed from the mist. Innocent souls can be perverted by rage and loss. But he unsheathes his sword and nods his readiness. If you're going to do it, you can do it now. Try to clean up the mess if it goes wrong. Lethoril. As you call forth Lethoril and command him to free himself, the crown crumbles in your hands. The light seems to fade from the forest. The ghost appears above you, twitching and writhing, expression flickering between uh, Beatic and Savage. Ghost. I feel like that's Beastic. Ghostly howls shriek through the trees. Salem looks over to you, eyes wide. He's been a ghost too long. The backlash from the magic is tearing him, his personality apart. You're the master, only you can affect him. Uh, shit. Quick link your mind with his and lend him your willpower. I'll try. 
Hey, it succeeded. A flash flood of memories that aren't yours pours through you. Scenes from the thrill of past at last the tide ebbs and the ghost looks down at you with clear eyes and kind expression. Thank you. I feel more myself than I have in ages. I will go now, tend to my force, and perhaps explore the realms beyond this one. He smiles. His smile turns dangerously. But when you find Nerissa's minions, well, just call my name and I'll do what I can. With that, the ghost vanishes. Salem gives you a nod and then touches a spiral amulet around his neck and disappears as well. Surprisingly, Shika laughs and turns a radiant smile on you. We knew you'd make the right choice. God of the future, remember. Everything's go going according to plan. Now, if you'll excuse me, we're late for an appointment, or was that early? The thoughtful expression, the eldest winks out of existence. Okay. Dimensional door. Okay. I missed this. I need to figure out how to get to it. We can't leave loot behind. Yeah, mild. That went surprisingly well. Like, I feel like there was supposed to be a fight. Or I felt like there was going to be a fight. Okay. So now, I'm gonna head back to my kingdom. I'm gonna sell a bunch of stuff. Deal with whatever's going on. Maybe build some stuff to help out with the... Uh, Like reputation or whatever. Yeah, how do I get up here? That is not far. Um is there like not a mobility check over here? Did we not see the mobility check? Was it on the other side? I missed it. Guess we can try over here. Blood Rager, uh, hmm, interesting idea. Stop it. Go over here. On a barbarian? What does Blood Rager do? Interesting. I was thinking about this, and I wonder how ridiculously fun or stupid it would be if you just created, like, four cleric-type characters that were all paladins. Just, like heavy tanks that could heal each other and just have them be ridiculously lawfully good a trivial matter 
and have them all do the shield wall and the flanking stuff. Just like all the team stuff. Applause, please. Applause, please. Wonder how that would work. I can see that being like either really stupid or really fun. And like each of them specializing in a different weapon. So like um they don't have to share anything. Right, because I was gonna give like three of them shields, three of them um two-handed weapons. And I just feel like that would be kind of a fun build. What's going on, Glory Mouth? I would create a new save, or like just a new campaign in general. Like from the start, and then like at low level, um, just sell all the stuff that I can to get enough money to create four or five NPCs beyond uh, Harem. Harem would be one, and then... Uh, I'd create five others. We should gather our strength. Oh, good lord. Is there no way to cross here? Oh, they're all tired. That's fine. Let's try to avoid this one. Dang. I think it would be kind of fun to do. Because, like, I don't know a lot of things that they couldn't. Ooh, crap. Hold up. They couldn't actually kind of take. Shit. Actually, yeah, fall back. Emery drink this. Not paying enough attention to this fight. You j actually just stop. Drink. Okay. Um, cast one more. You have another one? You do. Okay. Why is it always Alvers? Right. Like Alvers are the toughest NPC or mob in the game. Not NPC. I guess they're considered NPCs, but like Alvers do nothing but give me difficulty. This is just a random encounter with them too. And they have me scared. Oh my god. Okay, that one exploded. Good stuff. A rest would be welcome. Oh my god. Or yeah, you would have five people casting or six people casting flame strike. They could all heal each other. 
They could all keep each other from um in due time. Or like they could protect everyone from spells. And then you would just combo like the shield wall uh, with three of them. And then everyone gets the flanking one. That would be so ridiculous. Right. We should gather our strength. There will be like a time where I take a little bit of a break with this game, but I think it's been fun enough that I could definitely see myself revisiting it from time to time. But I've literally been playing it for the last three months. It is a long one. But I do kind of want to build a cleric run. I just think that'd be so much fun. At least run it up to like Act 3. Trying the speedrun? Maybe. How long does a speedrun take? Because I feel like speedrun in this game is a very relative term. Ten hours. Hmm. Ten hours. Well, it wouldn't be ten hours like the first time because I'd have to read through everything. Finish Act 4 in 6 hours. Interesting. Okay, your advisor has arrived to report about the recent relation development in your kingdom. Nothing's happened. That's good. I've learned to fear those reports. Okay. Hey, relations went up. That never happens. All these successes. Because I'm ignoring everything else and just letting them fail on their own. Forty percent, but that's still not high enough. Man, he doesn't have news. It's just him doing the same thing he always does. Let's just improve something real quick. Fifty, I'll do it. You have enough money. Start on the project. Support, 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 support. Eternal Guardians. I don't want that. Supporting fighting the foundation. This is for castle. Lighthouse military. I think these are okay, but I don't think they're that great. I feel like if you're playing for like temp like city building, they're great, but otherwise. I want to spend 300 gold. I want to know the person who actually chases this. Fifteen hundred BP, sixty days to resolve. Like, how much? What is my maximum BP right now? 
How much would it cost me to do 1500? It would cost me 120. I almost want to do it, but I don't have an advisor right now. Oh, wait, 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 instead of supporting him, I'll just put him in here. No, not you. Not this one. This one. I want to do it just to do it. Because I can actually afford it. I'd still have... 500 or 50, yeah, 515,000. That's not even what's in my inventory right now. Wait, how much did I just buy? That wasn't enough. I bought 1,200. Or did I spill? How much did I just buy? Yeah, I bought enough. I didn't. I don't know where it is. But I still have enough money for it. I'm doing it. We're going to be the greatest trade partners ever. And I have 94 days left, so I will see 30 days of that. No, I won't even see 30 days of that. The way Bald Hilltop goes, I'll see one week of that being off. Wow. Okay. <laughs> ah, that's fine. It's for posterity. We're doing this right now. I'm doing this so I can do at least one event. Because Lord knows I'm going to fail everything else. That's probably true. But then I have a feeling there's an achievement for that trade specifically. And I would like that. Oh, happy birthday to me. Nope. 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 It's just not worth sending them out to fail these. It really isn't. My god. It didn't make her any better. It made her worse. Oh, because of the bonus. Damn. Whatever. I forgot about the bonus thing. Okay. There. Go. Succeed at something. Did I do the one with Varnhold yet? I don't know. There's one that I'm sitting on. Your advisor. Okay. Nothing to report. Good. Okay, dragon. Greater Sting. Will I fail again? Still no Earthbreaker. The last time he came, uh, Farn, is it? Last time he came, he said he was building Earthbreaker, finally. And I don't have it. Does it have to be 9 before he gets back? Because I don't think it's 9 right now. As it should be. Yeah, he said he started on it the last time he came. Let's see what you have here. 
Okay. Didn't accidentally. Oh, okay. Amulet of Fragile Fists. I just don't see anyone using that over the other stuff we have. This could be interesting to keep for the right combo. When he uses that. I just want to keep that. That could be something Lindsay uses. Can't use that. Don't need that. Don't like that. I think the trade off's too poor. Don't have someone who's going to use that. Deal. Got so much money right now. Lindsay, what are you using? The escapist? Oh, that's her dimensional door, though. Okay. Getting rid of the acid longbow. Sharpbow. Or light crossbow. These are cool. If I could find someone who would have it. Okay. I did not give him specific instructions. I'm just waiting for him to finish. In fact, when he said he started it, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Do your thing, buddy. Does he have to, like, every time I get into the throne room? Couldn't it be, like, every week he could come up and tell me something? Like, I was just in here, man. It was the same update. No, no, no. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna call for tonight, get some rest, and then I'll be on tomorrow. <laughs> right? That's the thing. He keeps coming up to me. He's like, nothing to report, sir. It's like, okay, thanks. Thanks for the update. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Before I go for the night, let's talk to this spell. Storyteller. Got some relics. Tokens of triads. Ancient Elven beads. Yep, and I still need two more of the sky metal. So I know what direction I'm headed the next time I play. I'm going to go do one of those side quests. And I might go back to Pitox to see if I can just get those pirates to fight each other, since I can't give them the Grimoire. I'm going to see what the... Yeah, there's nothing... Alright, cool. But that's going to be for tonight. Um, tomorrow I'm not going to start as soon as I usually do. But I will definitely be playing this game around the same time. Which will be like 7. Or it'll be around 8pm Eastern. That's kind of when I've been starting this. So yep. I will see you guys tomorrow.
Oh, thanks for the raid again. I do appreciate it, SO. SUO. I'm gonna say your name right one of these days. <laughs>